Hello D&D TikTok and beyond and welcome to Roll for Sandwich, the series where I let fate decide my lunch. I got a lot of flack yesterday for not having a cheese column, so we have a cheese column now and I've made some adjustments. We're going to be rolling some different dice. Still only have seeded bread, so this is what we're using. All right, first up meat, two, tuna fish. Okay, well, the problem with tuna fish is that it doesn't go with a lot of other things, so today might be a bad day. We'll see. All right, next up the veggie, fruit, whatever the heck you want to call it. Uh, lettuce, okay, well, that's pretty normal. That's not going to cause any problems in my stomach with the tuna. It, all right, next we've got cheese, and I'm rolling a D4 for this. Four, no cheese. I am actually going to be rolling on the other column from yesterday. Still don't get cheese, apparently. But uh, let's see what we get for the other column. Three, roll veggie. Okay, so we are rolling again now uh, to put a second veggie. Uh, avocado, okay. Technically a fruit, according to lots of y'all, but uh, that's what we're doing. Avocado. Really, this is not that scary yet. This is actually sounds fine. All right, and last, we've got the sauce, rolling a D8. Added a couple sauces since yesterday, and mayo, okay. Mayo and tuna fish, did, man, okay. So there are a lot of ways in which, okay, that was a terrible squirt. Okay, um, <laughs> there are a lot of ways in which this could be, have been bad with tuna fish, and honestly, this is pretty normal. This is what I would expect to have on a tuna sa sandwich, except for maybe the avocado. Um, tastes fine, honestly, I mean, you know, not uh, nothing spectacular, nothing to write home about, but uh, I'm not puking. Uh, give it a 5 out of 10. Pretty much right in the middle.